桜桜弥生の空は見渡す限り霞か雲か匂いぞいずるいざやいざや見に行かん Many many years ago the people of a far off land gave some small brown trees as a gesture of friendship to a people many miles and many seas away. Trees were gratefully received by these people and they planted them in their great city along the flowing river and at the feet of one of their most honored men. The little trees flourished in this new land. And between the two peoples, there was trust and understanding. Early in the spring, rough winds would shake the trees into blossom. To the people of the great city, they were the most glorious blossoms in the world. People who strolled under the graceful trees paused for a moment and thought about how their trees came to be, and perhaps wondered about the people who had given them, so different and so far across the sea. For many years, the people of the great city enjoyed the time of the blossoms. But as the winds of winter and the fierce rains of early spring sometimes prevent the trees from bearing their delicate blossoms, so the relationship between the two people suffered doubt, misunderstanding, and war. Winter once more give way to the brisk, warm breezes of spring. The rain stops, the sun shines, and the earth is warm. Disagreements between the two peoples are ended. Faith and trust flower again. It is the time of the blossoms. Spring again. Life begins anew. And there are beautiful things to see.
painful things to see. The whole winter's thoughts to put into action, and there are dreams to make realities. Blossoms, and now across the world they sing a song of the sakura. Sakura, sakura, tender blossom born of spring, sighed by winter's gentle song. Once again you bless my eyes. Would thou thus return to me? Sakura, Sakura, would thou thus return to me? Their perfection is but a moment, for soon the blossoms will go. But their meaning and their beauty are memory ever after. Oh, my God. 